What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, as promised, I'm bringing you a video on my new Panzer AR-12. This is one badass gun. So this is the Pro model. The Pro model comes in all steel. It comes with extra chokes. Both models come with flip up sights and they both come with two five round magazines. The buttstock on this gun has an adjustable cheek rest. They have a nice rubberized grip. This gun is just awesome. As you can see, it's beautiful. It's, it's menacing looking. I mean, if anybody breaks in your house and you come at them with this thing, you almost probably don't even have to fire any rounds at them. They're gonna see this and run their asses off. Also, what's cool about this gun, as I said, both of them come with two five round magazines. They also have 10 round banana clips. Check this out. How freaking awesome does that look? <laughs> that is awesome. They also have a drum magazine and I do have one of those coming, but like everything shipping is super freaking slow lately so it's still in the mail i will do a separate video just on the drum mag because i know all of you want to see how good that thing functions i want to see how good it functions also but you know what's cooler than a panzer two panzers that's right guys this is the pro model and this is the standard model i'd like to say they were both my guns but I technically purchased this one for my father so that me and him could go out shooting and hunting or whatever, just having some fun, me and him, and have the same gun. Awesome. And like I said, guys, the only main difference in these two models is the Pro model is made all steel. It's made out of all steel, comes with extra chokes, and it comes with an extra uh, gas piston ring. That's pretty much the only difference in these two models that I've noticed. All right. Here's your sir. Now, one thing I want to tell you that is a little different on this gun than other guns I've had, because I've never had an AR-12, first one ever. The recoil spring, see it's normal, it's AR, so it's an AR platform type gun. Normally, an AR, you got the recoil spring and buffer tube in the back. With the AR-12, the recoil spring is in the front here. So that was just a little different to me, a little interesting of how it actually works. It's got a humongous heavy duty bolt. As you can guess, you're gonna be shooting shotgun rounds out of it. I don't know, it's just an awesome all around gun. Oh, and one thing I did forget between the Pro and the uh, standard model, the Pro model has a Picatinny rail on the bottom. It's just a little extra so you can put some more accessories, but if you're about all about accessories, you're gonna wanna get the Pro model. All right, I got lots of targets set up down range. Let's get to shooting this thing. Okay guys, first magazine, I'm gonna have this Remington Nitro Turkey two and three quarters, one and a half ounce shot. Pretty much today I am shooting what ammo I could actually find in stock, which isn't very much. I have no slugs. I just, I got what I got guys. It's gonna be an awesome video still. What I have noticed about this gun though, it does not like target loads. It does not like the low brass, low power shells. You can shoot them, but a lot of times it will not cycle the shot. So I recommend Obviously, this is a defense shotgun, as you could tell by how it looks. So, it only wants a high-powered round. One drawback of this gun. I have seen people shoot this gun with birdshot, and it cycled fine. Maybe after a break-in period, the recoil spring will get a little less tight, and it will cycle it. I haven't got to that point yet, though. So, for today's video, you are getting the good stuff. All 
Yeah, buddy. That's just awesome. All right. What's better to shoot with a shotgun than some two liters? You get some awesome freaking shots with two liter bottles. Let's go for them three up there on the piece of wood there. Awesome. This thing is, mm, pick one up. If it's not a Panzer, they have plenty of other AR-12s. I love this a lot more than my pump shotgun, that's for sure. All right, I got a head of lettuce down there on the right side. Let's take that thing out. Yeah. All right, final shot. I'm going to shoot that piece of tile right there in the middle. The gun has a bolt holdback. So when you get to the end of your mag, bolt stays. All right. For this five round magazine, we're gonna be using these Winchester Super X three inch shells, one and an eighth ounce two shot. Like I said, we're shooting what we got. These things are awesome also. Let's load it up and shoot some. Woo! All right. Let's take out them uh, other two liters down here on the left side on the ground. We don't let two liters live on this channel. Destruction, pure destruction. Let's take out that shaving cream right there, right up front. Woo! That creamed everywhere, didn't it? Yeah. Oh. Got to fix a flat over here with no lid. So I'm going to get rid of it. All right, let's hit that, that steel plate down there a couple times. I guess one time, that was my last shot. <laughs> this thing just runs flawlessly. All right, let's load the banana clip up. I have something special for that. All right, guys, here we go. Got the banana clip loaded up. Got one in the chamber. Got 11 rounds in this bad boy. We're gonna blow this stuff to smithereens. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Don't come in my house if you aren't invited. Because you are not going to make it out. Awesome, awesome gun. Hope you like that video, guys. As always, if you aren't subscribed, hit that subscribe button. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If I get enough thumbs ups, we'll get some more destruction on this channel. Take it easy, guys. Later.